What's up guys, my name is Insertech here and here we have the video review of the Otterbox commuter series for the Galaxy S2 smartphone. So let's get right, right into it. Uh, so this is a case that I bought around like three or four weeks ago and I'm glad to say that it's a great great case. So we're gonna start with opening up the packaging and stuff. Um, yeah, so we're gonna take it out of the packaging. By the way, I have used it. It's just that I repackaged it for the sake of this video. So, yeah. I don't remember how you take this out, really. You lift this up and take it out. <laughs> like that. Okay, so here's the case. I'm gonna attempt to pull it out of here. Okay, there we go. It's almost out. There. Why did that take so long? I have no idea. Well, here's the case, as you can see. It also comes with a screen shield. And uh, with that screen shield, we have three accessories, which are this installation card, which is really, really bad, as you can see. Um, this installation guide for the screen shield on how to put it down. And this microfiber cleaning cloth for cleaning your screen and stuff. This is for the International Galaxy S2, by the way. Um, I don't know if there are versions for the AT&T or T-Mobile or anything. You can go to otterbox.com for that or search it up on Amazon or something like that. Um, but I will leave a link down below to somewhere where you can buy it. I will put up, up a link on Amazon.com and Otterbox uh, official site. So we're going to insert the case into the phone. Nah, insert the case into the phone. Insert the phone into the case. Um, as you can see, oh, there's this like, um, there's, this is a two piece case. This is, there's this silicon part. Um, yeah. That you just stick into your phone. And then there's this, um, plastic, like, yeah, uh, plastic, um, second part of the case that you insert like this. Yeah. So I just put the case on the phone. Uh, so... Now we're pretty much set. I've also inserted the screen shield that comes with this case, and I'm glad to say the screen shield is great. Great quality. Um, yeah. It's a great quality screen shield. It isn't very fingerprinty, although it is a little bit more fingerprinty than the real screen, but it's a great static screen shield. It's got great quality. It got, it's got great protection. My screen hasn't, scr hasn't scratched any time uh, since then. Um, it's just a great screen shield. Uh, and it's a little bit weird there. There we go. It's just a great screen shield. Plus, it comes with all these things to install the screen shield. So let's put this to the side. So our main focus right now is the phone and the case. So let's start with the case review itself. So this is, a again, as I said before, a two-piece case, which covers almost the entire phone, as you can see. It covers this top, but not the bottom with the buttons and stuff. Mostly because these are capacitive buttons, so it can't cover that part, because you will not be able to see the capacitive buttons. Unlike the iPhone, which doesn't, so it does cover this bottom part. And it covers the bottom at the, the home button as well. Um, so, again, the screen shield is great. Um, this top part is fully covered. Here you have uh, cutout holes for your front-facing camera, uh, the sensors, and your speaker. Well, not your speaker, but the call speakers and stuff. So let's go to the uh, left-hand side. So here um, we have uh, the thingy magic here. <laughs> um, here we have our volume, um, our volume rocker, which works great. The uh, button feedback on this case is pretty darn nice, as you can see. It really like feels like a button. It's not like one of those cases where you just have to like. Uh, like, pull it so much, like, push it so hard for it to actually do something. So, on the right-hand side, we have our power button. Again, really tactile feedback, really uh, good uh, button. Really feels like a button. Here in the top, uh, we have our 35 millimeter headphone jack, which is covered by this, um, which can be, like, pulled out. So, that way, uh, none, no crap or lint or dust will get into your headphone jack. Plus, there's a cutout for the noise-canceling microphone. Um, here at the bottom, same thing, but for the, um, micro USB connector. Again, uh, covered, uh, here, so no lint or dust, uh, or any other crap can get in there. 
And again, another cutout hole for the second microphone. Or actually, this is the second, this is the first, whatever. Okay, so in the back, we have this really, really nice design. I really, really like the design of this case. It looks really nice. Um, I get Here you have a complete like uh, cutout hole for the camera and the flash and the um, camera itself, 8 megapixels. Um, it does have a flash diffuser, a plastic flash diffuser here, so no flash problems. The flash works great. Uh, here you have some OtterBox branding down here, and here you have a cutout hole for your speaker, uh, which um, doesn't decrease the volume by any means. So, is this case protective? I can say that yes. It definitely is. I've dropped this phone several, several, several times with this case and no problems whatsoever. The, the case protects the phone. The, the case, the, nothing has happened to the phone. It's great. It's super protective. Uh, looks really nice. I think it, this case looks really, really nice. It does pick up some fingerprints uh, here in the back sometimes, but it's not a whole like big issue. Um, although a big complaint that I do have with this case is, is that this uh, rubber, no, not rubber, but this part is made of silicon. Silicon picks a lot of, picks up a lot of lint and dust and crap. So that's like uh, an annoyance, but meh, it's not really that important. Um, yeah, so it does pick up some lots of lint and dust, uh, but it's not that annoying. As you can see, I have to clean it off very often for it to, like, get the lint and dust out. But, yeah, I guess that's it about to, like, talk about this case. So, it is super protected. I'll drop this several times and nothing has happened to the phone. The amazing screen shield and the great, like, super protective case work amazingly well together. Uh, nothing has happened to the phone and nothing will happen to it anytime soon. This case is great. What score do I give it, though? Well, for this little problem thing, and the fact that the screen shield actually bent it for me, so that's a little annoyance. I was very uncareful with the screen shield, so I guess that's not uh, their fault. It's my fault. Um, but I was really non-careful with the screen shield, so it bent it on the sides, and it has two big heaping bubbles on the sides because it's bented. It also has one up here because it also bented. Yeah. So, that's not my fault, so I shouldn't really, like, decrease points for anything. Uh, so, I will give this case a 9 out of 10. It's an amazing case, plus I actually shouldn't decrease points for the screen shield, just for the case. Um, but the case is great, the, the screen shield is amazing, really, really protective. Don't expect your phone breaking anytime soon. Thanks all for watching, guys. This has been Insert Tech here with the review of the OtterBox Commuter Series case for the Galaxy S2. Uh, I don't believe this is available in any more colors, but yeah. This does retail for $34.95 on Otterbox's site, but I believe you can get it a little cheaper on Amazon.com. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. This has been Insert Tech here, and I will be back soon. See you guys.